<laughs> Let's go welcome to the next episode of Fallout 4 Last Left Off. We're trying to have a civil conversation with Nick Valentine. But instead we're rudely interrupted by multiple, multiple raiders. We're gonna find a way to take him out. I'll tell you this. Ooh, looks like Valentine's been doing work on this guy. All those meat chef where are chunks here. Even Strong's helping out here. Row station. Who's left? It's like a raider outpost. Whoa! That's a legendary. We should probably back the heck up before we get smacked the heck up. We're about to get lit. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. <sighs> Daniel Deuce coming a long way. He said never underestimate us again. Be the judge of that. Gonna be a good fight. What is going on here? They're trying to stab us. <laughs> What's gotten into us? What has gotten into us? I don't have an it. Shenley's oyster bar. I don't know. Someone's upstairs, huh? Pipe pistol. Lucky leather right arm. I'd like to pick that up, but you know, I, I really can't right now. Because I'm overloaded. Alright, let's go ahead. We gotta find a way to get north of the wall. I guess the answer is to go into the Yo. Let's go into the oyster bar. It seems like a Bostonian thing to do. I actually am a huge fan of oysters. You put a little Tabasco on it, a little bit of real horseradish. Oh, the glands. The glands, alright. Look how much nicer the game runs indoor than. Who's there? Out of doors. What kind of gun is that? Man, we're on a tear right now. A pipe pistol. All right. I see that's a red plate, but it's not a clean red plate. We only serve clean at the Deuce household. Anything of value in here? Cleaner. Mac and cheese. No, thank you. It's got to be something in here. Is that it? Just two rooms? All right. Brain fungus. Ugh. Uh, looks like we need to eat something. And or drop something. Um. Drink a little dirty water. Actually, we should probably save those because we can cook that. Back bay. I think there's someone else up here, right? If I'm not mistaken. Let's find out. What do we got up here? Yep. Raider Psycho. Let's go for that left arm. You drop that pool stick. Get critical. I want him to drop the stick. Did he drop it? Cool cue. Pipe, bolt, action, snip rifle. No, thank you. Here's what we think about that. That's what we think about that weapon. <laughs> what else is up here? Little rad X. Sleeping bag, that's it. We cleared the place out. Can we go to the comic store now? Ooh, never mind. A little something something up here. Light bolt action pistol. Can't carry any of that stuff. I mean, for someone to not sit in that this chair, I mean, that chair was meant for this moment right here. Just taking it all in. Just taking it all in. Alright, let's get out of here. No, 
I almost, I thought we, that moment when you thought you were about to launch yourself off the top. We weren't trying to do that. All right. Can we, how do we get up there? I would really, that's worth a jump. What the heck? This is really the wall. This is almost worth a jump to me to see what this guy's carrying. Can we make that jump though? I think we can. We're gonna try it. Oh, we can make that jump. Yes, we ragdoll. I want our like normal armor just to look clean and red and shiny. I wonder if we can like polish armor in this. Mark one. We can make this jump. I know we can. Right, let's go first person here one more time. Question is, once we make the jump, how do we get down? Oh, that was not the way to do it. Hesitation. You just gotta go for it. We gotta be on the ledge and then just launch ourselves like so. It should load fairly quickly here, though. I just wanna know what that guy's got in his pockets. He had to die for a reason, right? Because he had something great in there. We can go even higher, huh? What's up here? Whoa. Clipping McGee. Let's see what's up here first. Ooh, a little hidden duffel. Yacht gun shells. It's a nice little hideaway. Alright, this is our last... Last attempt here. I think we can do it though. Slide. We gotta be on the ledge. There we go. Now you just gotta go for it. Oh. Jumping off of that was pretty stupid if you ask me. Was it? I wanna know what's up there though. Alright, so maybe we can get back to Valentine. <laughs> before we're rudely interrupted. Head back this way. Though I do want to find that comic store. Open Chained the on the other side. side. Who's there? And can we move for a minute? Caitlin. Kate did not jump. She. W Wait, this looks like the comic store right here. Hubris. We're into your boys. Scavengers, lead, bottle cap, melon. We get, we're gonna come back. I, cause I, you know, there's gonna be something great in there. Let's go ahead and let's have our final convo with Nick Valentine. Then we'll go and break some stuff down. Nick, here. are you ready to talk? How do you know to find me down in that old vault? Ellie, your secretary. She did. Now. Yes, we already talked I want about you this. To... I'll meet you there, buddy. I'll meet you there. See you in. Uh huh. All right. Unlike the Valentine, let's go ahead and save this so that doesn't happen again. We can't forget to go to Hubris Comics. We can't. So let's go ahead and should we go to Diamond City to sell? Yeah, let's do that. So let's go to Diamond City, which is wait, nope. We're gonna go to the market, sell some stuff here. Robco Fun Pip Fall. I wonder what that does. $40? 40 caps? What a rip. Each issue of Robco Fun includes a holotape inc containing a unique game which can be played on your Pip Boy or any terminal. We can check into that. Mr. Gutsy was created by General Atomics. If we're looking for some action, I'm betting we'll find it here. Alright, Kate, you're about to get. Don't dally. Shown the if you're door. Here to be examined. Let's get you examined. Barter. Actually, I need some. Um, let's. Okay, he's got 378. Let's start by selling. Not that. Um, I'm gonna keep anything gold. Cloth. Nope. Scissors. 
We should probably keep all this junk. We'll sell everything that's not junk. Let's see, but what is not junk? Hunting rifle. I don't know. I just have a hard time parting with everything. Uh, trusty Susan. Value is 120. Get rid of that. Which snipper rifle? Hardened is damage 48. That's damage 38. But I want to break off the calibrated and the bayonetta. Um, Mutant Slayer's tire iron. All right, let's accept this. Oops. There we go. Let's see what we can do here. Can we do any work? Can we upgrade our weapons or armor? Diamond City surplus. Everything you need. Um. Can we take this stuff off somehow? Don't Let's go back here. the wall undefended. High quality protection for sale. Lead lined. Mod something. I think we gotta go back home, to be honest. Keep away from my stall. I don't know you. What is going on? Yeah, let's go home and let's go back home, and then we'll dump all our stuff off. I think that's the best way we've figured out how to. Uh, Break stuff down, but I mean, I would imagine you could put like a bunch of mods on one weapon instead of just one. That's what you would think, but who am I? I'm just a guy controlling a guy named Daniel Deuce. They should really sell these at PAX. I would wear that one for sure. All right, let's go ahead and go to our workshop, transfer junk that is junk silver fork we got to keep keep you can keep the locket get that we're keeping everything else okay so there's that there's laser standard sight so let's go so we don't need to carry these mods Where's the mods at? Unless you, when you break it down? Wait a second. That's how it works, okay. So, so if we break down a weapon you here, if we scrap it, do we get the mod? I got it. Alright, so let's break down something we don't really care about. Sharp painted metal chest piece. So let's break this down. If we scrap it, do we get a mod? Item cannot be scrapped. Modify. Yes, we can't. Huh. We lack the requirements. Interesting stuff. All right, so let's figure out if this is better. So we have left arm. What's our current left arm? Is 13. That's damage resistance. Oh, that's three and six. This is three and three, but you can't see us. So let's make this better. Buttress improves damage and energy resistance. Do butt rest. Yeah, we'll make it. There we go. So that's better. Um, what else we picked up? Poison resistance, don't really care about. Charisma and intelligence, that's kind of cool. But it's not as good as our... But this thing. Lighter build, reduces weight. And more ballistic fiber, huh? Deep pockets. Rank 2 armor. Are we rank 2 armor? If 
we can, we're gonna go put some leather in there. All right, so let's see what our new, we're gonna put on that new left piece and see what that looks like here. I guess it's that top thing that's sticking out. All right, so there's that. And then maybe we get some, some of this leather in here and break that down. Look at our quantum. Someone moved it. It's not supposed to be like that. It's supposed to be standing up. It's supposed to be standing up. Jerk. Can't believe is there a way to don't want that. We'll just take anything leather here. Leather. You might want to think about dropping some of that craft or carrying. Calm yourself. Alright, so we want to go transfer. Let's might as well put our tuxedo in here while we're at it. And then, Vault 114 jumpsuit for now. And then we're good to go here. And then now we should be able to make this upgraded, right? Lighter build. Well, oh, there's something in here. Something that says, oh, we're not. Something said rank two armor. Reduces radiation damage. I got it. Okay, deep pocketed. So we need to break down some leather. So then, how do we scrap the leather? Transfer it here? I believe that's how it works. We've never really had to do that. So is that broken down officially? So we're gonna go chest piece. It's hmm. not the case. Whoa, 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 what happened to our pants? happened was it because it wasn't broken down is that why we have a problem we had leather pants or something oh no we didn't have that um guess we have to break this stuff down you wouldn't think that's the case but we'll try it I guess that would make sense. You have to break it down at the armor. Help defend Templine's bluff. Whoops. So we want to scrap this. Wow. You just get one leather for that, huh? Lightweight metal chest piece. Can't break that down. Okay, so now, all right, so let's go back here. Then we'll go to our chest piece. Oh, we can make deep pocketed, nice. Yeah. It's a lot of leather, but we'll take it. Okay. So there's that. So our chest piece is good, left arm. Stabilized. So we need to break down all this crappy armor we're walking around with. Probably make. Reduces limb damage. Probably pocketed. Alright, so that's pocketed, pocketed. No misc. Cushioned. Muffled. Sleek. Muffled requires what? Reduces detection from moving. Strengthened. 
what, what increases are? It's not much. It's not. That's not not really that good standard though. Shadowed metal, polished metal. Improves damage resistance. Let's do that. I like that. Um, Raider right leg. It's already butt dressed. Strengthened. Lighter build. Cushioned. Limb damage. I don't really care about that stuff. Muffled. Eh. It's kind of a waste, I think. Um, right leg. Metal arm. Painted metal. Alloy metal. Let's go polished metal. Uh, metal right arm, that's pretty good. I think, can we scrap this? Cannot be scrapped. Okay. And we need to improve this. Protective lining. Insulated lining. Treated lining. We need some more leather. You break any more crap down that we have? I don't think so. So I guess that's pretty important. Picking up stuff is pretty important for... Like, picking up that garbage is pretty important for the stuff. Also, there's some stuff in here that's questionable. Some really questionable stuff here. So I wish you could break it down in here, but it's not how it works. So we'll take, uh... Break down all this raider stuff. Sack hood. I don't think we can break that down. So a lot of people say, hey Dan, why are you saving all your armor? Why are you saving all your armor? Well, that's why. I just don't fully understand the, the modding, like what we can plug in and what we can not plug in there. Is that better than we have now? It's 3 6. No, scrap. Uh, scrap, scrap, scrap. I wonder if this is the only place you can break down armor. Probably. We should probably have a, just a chest here. Next to here with where we just put our armor. That's probably the best idea. So let's actually let's do that right now. So we'll go workshop. And then we'll go container. Wait, what would it be in? Furniture. Container. Put something. Something that fits. What's a good fit? Yeah, that'd be cool if we could put that right there. Steel cabinet. That doesn't really fit though, for what we're trying to do. Metal box. That looks good there. Steamer trunk. I like the metal box. metal box like like so all right so let's go ahead and no so let's go here we're gonna transfer all the armor that we don't really know what we're doing with yet um, painted metal arm mod that must fall off when we Broke that one down? That's the only answer I have for that. So let's go ahead. Anything we're not wearing. Raider leathers. We got to break those down. Like anything starred. Just keep in there for now. All right. So let's craft this. Some more stuff we can break down. No? So everything else we can't break down. That's odd. We are, we are currently in our undies though. All right. So let's go back here. We're going to... Transfer, I guess, the rest of this crap. Let's see, if we can't break it down, why can't we break that down? I don't have an answer for that. Ooh, look at our carrying capacity went up. I like it. I guess it auto-breaks it down, I guess. Sack hood. Alright, so there's that. Oh, let's go back here and then move the rest of our armor. And where did our quant? Oh, I was about to freak out. 
say where did our quantum go, but we know where it went. Um, so anything that's not armor, we're going to leave in here. That's armor. Ragtag, that's just... That's armor. Spike armor. That looks kind of cool. Why aren't we messing with that? We'll save that for him. Okay, that's it. Why aren't we wearing the spike armor? Is it because it's a one piece? Yeah, that's why. Yeah, it's kind of weak sauce too. Alright, let's go ahead and also transfer. We're done with this helmet forever. Let's dump this helmet in there. Damage res resistance is pretty good. Flight helmet was garbage. How did that get in there? Really, that damage resistance is pretty good. Sack hood. Huh. Put those on for now, too. I mean, I guess we should probably keep it, huh? Looks so bad, though. Let's go ahead and, you know, maybe we give the spike armor to, uh, to Kate over here. That could work. Hey, come What you need? Let's give you the spike armor. See how you look in that, Kate. She can't carry anymore. Got it. It's my fault. Let's go ahead and we have a couple of things we need to do here. Right? Transfer some stuff that we're gonna break down. Not now, but in the future. Like this and this and this and this. And everything else is pretty good here. Uh, on those. Oops, want to put those on actually. All right, so let's give her. Come here, Kate. Hey. Point out what you need, and I'll get right on it. Give us all your junk here. <laughs> come here. Wait there. Leaving me behind. It's your funeral. This is my favorite part of the job. She's got jokes. All right, so let's go ahead and. Wow, she's carrying nine pistols. I don't even know. I, it's so hard to keep track of all this stuff. Let's go ahead and give her this spike armor. Where'd it go? Looks like a boss. Where did her glasses go? We took them, right? Corset. Fashionable glasses. She needs to put those on. Spike armor. Good. She'll put it to good use. All right. Why bother? That's just garbage. And then let's wrap things up here by clean coffee cup. Keep the comfy pillow. We got to be very careful what we dump in there. Pack of cigs, paintbrush. It's fine. Silver bowl. We're keeping that. Silver fork. Soap. We're keeping. Spring. Steel, I can go in there. Teddy bear, we're keeping. I'm keeping all that. Alright. And then is there any apparel that we picked up that we don't want? Keep the corset. Helmeted cage armor. What? Where did that even come from? Edge, I toss it. She just say B word? What is this? Helmeted cage armor. Oh, we had this for a while, huh? Life still ain't perfect, but we're surviving. Alright, Marcy, you do your thing. I'm gonna go ahead and We gotta figure this out here. So much stuff. Um That was some good armor though. Uh patch three piece suit. I think what we're gonna do here. So we're gonna wrap things up 
And uh, when we return, we'll be armored up and everything will be back to normal for the most part. Well, in the next episode, we'll come back and we will uh, we'll place our new items that we've taken from the wasteland and then get back out there. We won't do any home improvements yet, but we'll be developing the spoils of war and uh, placing them throughout our humble abode. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, let me know in the comments below in our hipster haircut. I will see you guys next time.